Hi students, it's Teacher Ham here. How are you today? Hope that you're all doing okay. Welcome back to Teacher Ham's Tongue Twisters. Let's look at today's new tongue twister, number 11, Rory's Rake. Number 11, Rory's Rake. Rory's lawn rake rarely rakes really right. One more time. Rory's lawn rake rarely rakes really right. Okay, students, I hope you're enjoying this tongue twister so far. Rory's rake. Seven words in this tongue twister, which makes it not a very big tongue twister, but there's lots of different sounds going on. I've highlighted the sounds I think you should be aware of. For example, the consonant R, the R sound, is very well used in this tongue twister. In Rory's, rake, rarely, rakes, really, and right. So it's in every single one of the words bar one. So you have to practice that R sound and get that as good as you can. We've also got uh, Lee. Lee, L-Y and L-L-Y, and also Y in Rory, E. So we've got Rory, rarely, really. So we've got that ending sound, which is the same across three of the words. We've also got the long A vowel, ache, this time with a consonant K, ache in rake and ache in rakes. For the word really, we've got eely, eely, and the word right, we've got it. So we've got the full kind of range of the vowel sounds there. We've got eely, it, ache. We've also got in the words Rory's and lawn the sound or, which is stronger in the first word or Rory's, and uh, slightly uh, less strong in the second word lawn. Or, 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 Rory's lawn, Rory's lawn. In my opinion, the first word is the most difficult to master because you've got that R sound coming two times very quickly, so you have to read it in a very clear way. Otherwise, it all sounds a little bit uh, clumsy and not well pronounced in your mouth. So. Rory's, Rory's, Rory's. You have to have a clear difference um, between the two R sounds. Rory's. One is starting and ending, and then the other one starts. Rory's, followed by the E, the, the Y. Rory's, Rory's, lawn. Rake, rarely, rakes, really, right. For me, the other words are okay. Actually, you can practice those uh, individually, you can break the sounds down, but the first two words are the most difficult, I think. If you can practice those, that will set you up nicely for the speed read. Thanks a lot, guys. Okay, students, I'm just going to give you a few seconds to do the speed read on your own. Are you ready? Let's go. Okay, now it's Teacher Sam's turn. I hope that you could read it very quickly. hope that you're happy with that. Now it's Teacher Ham's turn. Rory's rake. Rory's lone rake rarely rakes really right. Okay, that's my best effort. It's quite slow, but I'm sure that you can do a much better job than me, as always. Go back use various parts of this video to help you master this tongue twister. Like I said, the first two words I think are the most difficult. The rest of the words you just have to be careful to pronounce the R sound correctly along with the different vowel sounds that are included in those last five words. Rake, rarely, rakes, really, right. If you can do that and have a clear separation between the sounds, You'll be fine, and I'm sure you can do a great speed read. All the best with that, students. I look forward to sharing number 12 with you very, very soon. 
Take good care. See you next time. Goodbye.